Hey guys, it's your girl Gordon Jylene. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a tutorial on this eye look that I currently have. I use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Palette. I know I am so late on this wagon, but I'm actually really not. I've had this palette for a while and I just never did any looks with it, surprisingly. As you can see, I hope you can see, it is very well loved. This palette is so me. This is my number one palette in my collection. I love it because I love reds. I love oranges. I just love warm toned eyeshadows. And I mean, there is like a few cool tones in here, but they are beautiful. These blend terrific. They are very pigmented. I mean, they do have a little bit of, you know, well, not a little bit. They have a lot of kickback when you put your brush in it, so you have to be really careful and, like, tap off the excess. But I honestly really don't mind. These are amazing shadows. A little goes a very long way, but if you do use a little bit too much, it blends out beautifully. By the way, I'm really sorry if my lipstick does not look that good. And sorry for the hair. I'm actually recording this intro and the outro after I've been wearing this makeup for like what time is it? For like 12 hours actually. So there's a little wear test for you too. Um, this palette lasts a long, long time on your eyes. Also, sorry if the Dora in the corner bothers you. I've had that thing since I was in elementary school. My best friend gave it to me and I still have it till this day. So, <laughs> sorry if it's a little distracting. And also, disclaimer, my nails are not fresh or anything. So, yeah. Let me stop laughing over here. <laughs> Let's get into the tutorial. I'm gonna start off with the color Burnt Orange as my transition color and I'm just putting that all over my crease. Next, I am taking the color Warm Taupe, just to darken up the crease a little bit. And I'm going to use a clean, fluffy brush to just blend those two colors together. I am now taking Golden Ochre to further blend those colors together. Next, I am taking this beautiful orange called Realgur and I'm putting that on the inner half of my lid. Now I'm applying red ochre to the outer half of my lid. Now I'm just blending out those colors a bit more. I'm going to be applying the color Primavera with my finger to the center of my lid. Or Primavera, as I would say it. <laughs> I'm going to be using Tempera for my brow bone highlight. I love this color. It has a beautiful sheen to it, but it's not shimmery. And for my inner corner highlight, I am just going to be using Vermeer. So off camera, I applied some liquid eyeliner and now I'm just using the NYX Slide On Glide On Eyeliner in Golden Bronze. And 
And now I'm applying the color Love Letter to the lower lash line. And I also put some mascara on off camera. You can feel free to put on some false lashes, but I don't really wear false lashes. And that is the finished look. Okay guys, that concludes this tutorial. This was just a very simple, basic look that you can get from using this palette. I highly recommend you buying this palette. It is amazing, but if you don't like warm tones, I suggest you try it in store, like swatch it on your arm or something. Even try it on your lids. Well, then again, you don't know how sanitary those are. But swatch them on your arm. <laughs> See how you like it and then decide whether you want to buy it or not because I think it's really worth it. I am most likely going to be doing more looks on my channel with this palette. This was just my first one. But thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!